Hey guys, so today we're installing the Genrite fuel pump access door. Um, super easy little project, but I want to show you guys uh, what we got going on here. So some of the stuff it comes with. Um, this is the cover plate right here. Comes with all the hardware you need and uh, the instructions. Um, we're already started on painting the outer bracket I guess you could call it that's gonna sit in the cutout and uh, I'll take you guys over here and show you the cutout that I've already done um, super easy anybody could do this but it's gonna be a lot nicer than what I had before all right so the insert is all dry and uh, I have it set in the hole here um, next thing we're going to do is drill out the holes for the rivets and then we'll go ahead and attach those and we're going to throw some silicone in between the uh, body and the bracket here and then we'll rivet it down and we should be good to go. Alright so now we have the bracket all riveted down here. Super simple process, just drill your holes and put your rivets in and so now last thing to do is maybe cover up our hole with this plate nicely cut aluminum plate there holes are all pre-drilled and uh, screw it down we're gonna be good to go okay. it's all finished that is the genrite fuel pump access door um, Hardest part about putting this in is probably cutting the hole for it. Longest part of it is probably honestly waiting for the paint to dry on that bracket. Um, other than that, probably two hours max to install this thing. And uh, honestly, a great upgrade. You're gonna have to get to your fuel pump at some point. I know I have. And uh, unless you wanna drop the fuel tank every time you do, this is the way to go. All right, guys, have a good one.